HCF of 27, 36 and 39. To find the HCF, for that we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. What I mean is 27 36 39 This is your step 1. Next. Here we have 27. 27 is 3 9's 27. Now 9 is 3 3's 9. Now 3 is a prime number so 3 1's 3. Now the other number. 36 last digit 6 e1 so take 2. First number 3. A number close to 3 in 2 table is 2 1's 2. 3 minus 2 1 1 carried forward 16. When do we get 16 in 2 table? 2 8 16. Now 18 is 2 9's 18. 9 is 3 3's 9. Now 3 is a prime number so 3 1's 3. Now the other number. Last digit 9 not e1 so not divisible by 2. Next prime number 3. To check divisibility by 3. For that add the digits. 3 plus 9. We get 12. And 12 is divisible by 3. So this number also divisible by 3. So take 3. First number 3. When do we get 3 in 3 table? 3 1 3. The other number 9, when do we get 9 in 3 table? 3, 3 is 9. Now 13, 13 is a prime number, so 13, 1 is 13. Therefore, our HCF is, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present in these three places. That is here and here. And also here, I repeat, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present in these three places. So now let us find the numbers which are present here and here and also here. Starting with the number 3. Do we have 3 here? Yes. Go to the next place. Do we have 3 here? Yes. So cut 3 right here. Next number 3. Do we have 3 here? Yes. Go to the next place. Do we have 3 here? No. 3 is not present in all the 3 places so we cannot write here. Next number 3. Do we have 3 here? Yes. But we don't have 3 here so we cannot write here. So no more numbers have been left out. So we got only one number 3 present in all the 3 places. So 3 itself is our HCF.